Hi, right, so today on the channel, I'm going to be showing you how to bake peppermint brownie loaf. First thing you do is pour this in. Whoa. Mmm, smells good. Very peppermint. This is my Happy Flash Friday, by the way. This is Flash Friday. I named, I named it. I I gave Friday. I uh for me, I call it Flash Friday. Why is that? Because today is Flash Friday. I know, but what, what makes you say Flash? Because I run like the Flash. All right. What's the next step? Okay. After you turn, after you plug, after you dump that in, it says. I think you're supposed to pour the water in first. What does it say? What does it say to do? Oh man, where, where, here? Yeah. What? Right there. One box of Trader Joe chocolate peppermint. Loaf baking mix, one large egg. Okay, I gotta dump the uh, I got I gotta crack the egg. I gotta put the egg in next. Right. I see. Um. All right. Let's see what the next step is, guys. Um, one cup of water. Pour that in. And then, um, one and a half cup of oil or melted butter. Nobody's drinking the orange juice. Just give it away. Oh, somebody is. This is one and a half. What, what was that you just put in there? It's oil. Half and, cup? Yeah, one and a half. Um, eight by four loaf pan. What what kind of pan does it say to do? I would say, where is it? What kind of pan? Oh, it's a loaf pan. I'll get you a loaf. What pan. does the loaf pan look like? Here it is, right here. It's like a loaf. See, no, it's shaped like a loaf of bread. Oh, this? Mm-hmm. Mom already greased it. I guess I'm supposed to add this butter, right? Well, how did that butter get on there like that? Okay, let's see. One box of Trader Joe chocolate peppermint loaf baking mix. Check. I already did that one. Are you heating up the One oven? large egg. Already got that. One cup of water. Already got that. One and a half cup of oil. Already got that. Eight. And then I'm not sure what this is. What is this? Mm. Um, that's which one? That's the pan. That one. That's the pan. Okay, so we gotta mix it up. So we don't need. how much butter it's supposed to. No, be. I don't think it needs butter. I don't think. Nope. Does oh wow! Yeah, it is a half a cup right there. That's... Okay, so th that's. Wait, that's not a, that's not a half a cup. Yeah, it is. This is half. Oh no, a half a cup. This is a half. This is a half a cup of butter. Um, did your mom do that? Yeah, go ask her. I thought a half a cup was one, is like one stick. Two sticks makes a cup. Is this a half a stick? Is this a half a stick? That is, hold on, let me, I'm pretty sure. You should go to... ask her before well, I dump this. I should this. know that by now. I mean, I've only been cooking for a hundred years. Where is your butter? Oh, here we go. Somebody oh, texted Samuel. me. Look, right here. Look at this stick. It says, um... Wait, so how much butter do two, I need okay, to add? Okay, two, two sticks is one cup. So you need, you need one stick for half a cup. Yep, and that's not one stick. You gotta cut, you gotta put this whole thing in there. That's crazy. That's crazy. Let me look at that. That doesn't sound right. One half cup. Oh, oil or melted butter. Okay. Yeah, right I'll... here it says, it says one stick. Look, Sam. I already did the oil. You put oil in it? Yeah. Oh, then you don't want to put. Wait, Mom. Am I supposed to add the butter? Oh <laughs> uh, yeah. Well, 
either that or you're gonna have to get a half a cup of oil. Because I already and did the oil. So yeah, if you you can add butter or oil, guys. So, add butter and oil, so but should I go ahead and should I go ahead and mix it? Should, should I go ahead and mix it? Oh no, it's off. It's warm. Sh should I go ahead and mix this? Yep, stir it really good. All right, time to mix it, guys. Okay, you can add bu back. butter or oil. I just it's realized that, good. guys. Mmm, okay, smells really good. The oven should be beeping soon. Simon. Our dogs being crazy. Make sure you always use a whisk. I met, I made a mistake in the pancake video. How to make pancakes? I got the pancake mix stuck on the spoon. So make sure you always use a whisk or something metal like this. That way, that way, cause it comes off easier. Make sure you stir this up real good, guys. Look how good this is looking, guys. They keep leaving me. I don't know what's got to be next, guys. Mmm, smells good. Make sure you stir it up real good. The ingredients real good. Hopefully Simon's not going crazy again. Okay, that's probably good, guys. I'm gonna use something more like this size, guys. So you kind of want to like watch this. Oh, that's kind of too far away. Hold on, let me let me make it higher. That way, um, you can watch recording because I kind of put my iPad a little too high, guys. I guess I gotta find something to make to lower it, guys. Let's try this salt. Let's try this salt holder. No, that's not gonna work. Yeah, let's bring my iPad down a little bit. Move this out of the way. Make sure I got this all stirred up. Some people's gas stoves, uh, ovens take a while to preheat and some of them don't, but we had another gas stove that our oven broke and we had to get a new gas stove a long time ago. So this one kind of takes a lot longer though. All right, that's probably good guys. Time to pour it in. Mix up, uh, mix up, uh, mix up. Uh, pour up, uh, pour up, uh, pour up. Uh, bake up, uh, bake up, uh, bake up, uh, cake. That song's from Blues Clues, guys. I think it's about to beep, guys. I'm gonna have to edit this video too, guys. I gotta see what the timer says, uh, how long to put it, set the timer for. Don't waste any of this, guys. You don't wanna waste it. Make sure you get as much as you can out of this bowl, guys. It's not good to waste your stuff. 
I know when we go to fast food restaurants, I eat every bit of my food, but not everyone else. Not my dad and mom. They don't. They always like to have leftovers, but not me. I like to eat every bit of my food every time I go out to eat. I don't. I don't ask for to-go boxes every time. Gonna fit any more? Oh, good. Simon's not crying anymore. Let's see what the timer says. Oh, uh, what's the stick of butter for? Mom, was I supposed to post a stick of butter in? No, we already did it. Okay, I wasn't sure. Uh, okay, let's see what the preheat. We'll see what the set. Let's see what the timer says. Timer. Let's see. Where's the timer on this thing? Mom, what does what it say? That, what, how, how long do I put the... How long do I set the timer on this thing? Oh. That's what I forgot to read. Wait, it's on the side here. 350. 350. For right there. For 15 minutes. That's it? Yep, 15 wow. minutes. Oh, that's pretty fast. Alright, time to set the timer for 15 minutes. That's actually pretty quick, guys. Alright, time to wait 15 minutes, guys. Alright, time to pull the brownie loaf bread out of the oven to check it. We gotta check it, and if it's not done, we gotta add three more minutes. Don't turn the oven completely off, guys. We gotta check it first. Alright, this is how you check it, guys. This is, if it's still kind of gulpy inside, this is how you check it, if you want to know if it's ready. Yep, we need three more minutes, guys. Let's put it back in. I'm going to need two oven mitts. I don't want to burn myself. Let's put it back in. We need an extra three minutes. If you see that it's gulping inside still like that, it needs an extra three minutes. Let's put it back in. Set the timer. And then we'll check on it in a little bit, guys. All right, time to check it again. Don't turn the oven completely off until it's ready. Oh, hold on. It might be ready this time. Hold on one second. Yikes. I'm kind of scared. Let me use this, hold on. I don't know how I'm gonna. I don't know how I'm gonna uh, take this out. I'm afraid I might drop it. First of all, you need two uh, things for your hands. Oh, good, good. Oh, that's not done. See how it's wobbly? Yeah. Yeah, it has to be firm. I did Ooh. extra three minutes. I did an extra three minutes. Oh, it's looking good, guy. I mean, folks, it's looking good. All right, well, should I set the timer to again? I think maybe 
minutes. I did three minutes. We need five minutes, folks. We need five more minutes, guys. I mean, guys. Start. All right, we'll check on it a little bit. Let's wait for the timer to go off again. <laughs> All right, time to check it again. Sorry about this. We checked it like three times, it feels like. We got, we got, we, we got, t we got to stick a toothpick in there and see if it's ready. That's how you can know if it's ready. Mmm, it smells pretty good. Um, hold on, where's my toothpick? Mom, what happened to the toothpick? What? I heard it is. This is how you can know if it's ready, guys. I'm stabbing it. Mom, come tell me if what you think. What? No, it's not ready. Uh, uh, come here. I gotta show you something. Ready? Look. What do you think? That's pretty dirty. What? Is that normal? It's supposed to come out clean. Oh, it's not ready yet, guys. Yep, still a little bit. Still a little bit, guys. We'll get it. Oh, yeah. When you see a wiggle like that, too, you... I see you guys are making me not put enough time on it. If maybe put, let's put, uh... Let's put five, uh, eight minutes. Okay. Uh-oh. Push that. Now, God. Let's, well, let's try eight minutes. Let's see how that does. We'll check it on in a little bit, guys. Sorry it's taking so long, guys. Hey, time to check it again, guys. I think he didn't hear it. Time to check it again, guys. Don't turn the oven completely okay. off, guys. Ooh. Can you shake it a little bit just to see if it wiggles? If it wiggles, then it's... Oh, uh, I need a, I need another oven mitt. Where's the other oven mitt? Right here. Right that way I'll burn myself. Here, Samuel. <clears throat> oh, here's the, one, here's the one I like. This is the only one I like. I like it when you use the crab claw. So I burnt myself on that before. Oh no, it's not done. I see it wiggling like crazy. Oh yeah, wow. true. Oh my gosh. Man, it's taking forever, guys. Are we sure we have it on the right temperature? Yeah, we have it on the right temperature. Let's thing. let's do another oh. let's do, let's do another five minutes, guys. No, I think you need more, at least ten. Yeah, let's do ten minutes this time. I don't think we can overcook. Oh my gosh, it says. What? Bake for one hour. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and then it says, we, <laughs> he was showing me the box and he was like this. And I said, oh, Sometimes she's colorblind, guys. Sometimes she's blind. So, how long did you say that? Uh, 15 minutes? So, we've done I'll two. Do 20 minutes. We've already done 15 and 18. So, what should I do? 20 minutes? Do 15. Make up your mind, guys. Yeah, try 15. I'll do 20 just in case because I don't, sometimes I don't trust you guys. Okay, do 15, 20. That sounds I, I, I'm, like, I'm like the expert here, guys. <laughs> I feel like I know yeah. more than they do. All right, we'll check in a little bit, guys. Okay, guys. All right, time to check it again. I know this is getting really ridiculous, but now I know it takes a whole hour. All right, don't turn it completely off yet until we poke it with a uh, toothpick. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta make sure it's done. We gotta, we gotta uh, stab it with a toothpick. Oh, actually, it looks pretty dumb. But let me just stab it with a toothpick real quick, though. Make sure you get a fresh one. These are kind, these are kind of hard to get out. Oh, here we go. Yep, it's done. Oh, 
It looks pretty done to me. All right, let's turn the oven off and try some, guys. Wait, hold on. Let me keep let me keep stabbing it with the uh, what's this? Make sure it's done. Yep, it's done. All right, let's turn the oven off, guys, and try some. Let me get a plate. I'm gonna get a small plate instead. I'm gonna get a paper plate instead and try it. This is the kind of... This is the kind of plates they usually use, but I like to buy the ones that say happy birthday on it. Whenever it's my birthday, I like to get the ones that say happy birthday on it. Whenever it's somebody's birthday or my birthday. Alright, um, we gotta find a small, we gotta, we gotta find a small knife so that we can, uh, scoop it out. Sorry that took so long, guys. Hey mom, what kind of knife should I use to scoop it out? I guess this will work. Ah! I burnt myself. I better, I better put the oven mitt on. I accidentally, I accidentally put the, uh, I accidentally, uh, touched the, uh, the, the glass part. I burnt myself. Oh my gosh. How do you get this? Make one of those every day. Make one of those baking things every day. What? You could start making those things for Sunday when we have church. What do you mean? You know how everybody brings something? Well, you could you could make something for for everybody and put it out on the table like everybody does. I'm giving this a test trial. See see how I like this. Let's give it a test run. What's your favorite uh, thing? Do you like pumpkin spice? What? Do you like cinnamon? Do you like cinnamon? Pumpkin no. spice? What's no. your favorite flavors? I don't like I don't like pump I don't like cinnamon. I'm even though I'm not. I used to be allergic to cinnamon, guys, but I don't like cinnamon, even though I'm not allergic to cinnamon anymore. Oh, you're doing a video still? Yeah. Oh, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hi, everybody on the channel. Welcome back. All right, let's try it, guys. Time to try right, it. Guys, now we stick a toothpick in it to see if it's uh, ready. No, literally, no, no, literally, it's ready, but hold on. Let me move this real quick. Literally, guys, it's ready. Literally. Literally, it's ready. This for, for real. Not a joke. This is not a joke. Let's let's try it. Mom, you want to try some? Let's make it. It's it's ready for real this time. Let's try it. I already did. I'm trying it. Make sure you blow on it. You don't want to burn yourself. One time I burnt my gum. I uh. I, I, uh, it hurts so bad. I burnt my gum on a piece of pizza one time. Make sure you blow on it a little bit. Yeah, you never want to burn your juicy fruit gum, folks. Never. You ever burn the roof of your mouth, bro? Yeah, I burnt my gum before on a piece of pizza at Sopranos. Leave a comment below if you like Sopranos pizza in Ocean City, guys. What kind of gum? What? What's your favorite kind of gum? Extra. Extra? Mmm. This is pretty good brownies. Oh, you made brownies? Yeah. Oh, I thought they were peppermint something. Yeah, peppermint brownies. Oh, are they good? Yeah, you gotta come over. You wanna come over and try some? Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll come over and try some. Can this... I have some Horizon milk with that? No, they, for some reason they don't have any right now. Oh, I thought they went out of business. Uh, I don't know how true that is. 
Uh, and likely. This is delicious, guys. I'm gonna send this video to Trevor and Kara and Emma. See what they think about my uh my baking video. How to bake a uh, how how to bake. This is delicious, guys. I'm probably not gonna eat the whole thing. I've actually put too much on my plate. I'm just giving it. I'm. I'm. I'm taste. I'm test tasting it. This is delicious. I never had this before. I'm gonna start getting this at Trader Joe's every time I go. Trader Joe's is number one, guys. For when you go to Annapolis or anywhere where you see a Trader Joe's, Trader Joe's is the best place to shop, guys. This is delicious. Hey, boy, you want to come try some? Come try some. Yeah, it's delicious. Whoa. I'm gonna sit on the um, kitchen counter. Delicious. Well, it's almost four o'clock, guys. Almost done. This is the best uh, peppermint um, brownie cake ever. I'm watching Backyard again, but right now I'm doing a tutorial video. This light now, it takes a whole hour to cook this, but I don't know why um, I didn't see the uh, timing part. Alright, time to throw my plate away. That's how you make a uh, peppermint brownie cake. Comment, like, subscribe, always share on social media, and click the bell and turn on all notifications. Thanks for watching. I'm Samuel Sands, the world famous YouTuber.